As of March 16th, Temple University has terminated face-to-face -face instruction and become an online-only school for the remainder of the spring semester due to the coronavirus. Students were encouraged to leave campus and return home. Those who were living in dorms are being told to move out before March 21st. Students like Ellie Cook and Victoria McIntyre have chosen to stay in their off-campus homes for the duration of the semester. So before Temple had all of its classes moved online, um, I was supposed to study in Germany at the end of the semester and that was canceled, which canceled three of my credits. And I was also doing an internship for three credits and they actually told me that they didn't need me anymore. After Temple announced that they're moving to online classes um, and they were telling everyone to go home, I'm actually stuck here at my off-campus apartment and I can't go home. Philadelphia is currently trying to flatten the curve by ordering non-essential businesses to close, restaurants to only offer takeout, and have also asked all gatherings of over 50 people to be canceled or postponed for the next eight weeks. I decided to stay on campus because I have a job in the city, um, but a couple of days after Temple closed down, I got word that um, my job was also going to be um, suspending sales in the dining room. My one professor, he kind of gauges how fast or slow he should be talking by watching us take our notes and by watching our, or by um, how many questions are asked. So there's a lot more breaks within the class period in person to kind of process all the information. Um, but over Zoom, he's just kind of speeding through all the information. In most of my online classes, they're just throwing so much more work that wasn't uh, like on the syllabus to begin with. And I just feel like it's a lot more than what I was expecting. Reporting for Temple Update, this is Kelsey Bussett.